uh, they played well. They played smart. They got us to slow the game down. They spread us out and did some good things. And big kid played very well and aggressive for them. And they did a very nice job. Was that a surprise to you at all that they were able to, to kind of, I mean, you won the boards, but that, that they kind of held their own at least in scoring? Not really. No? No, I thought, you know, I think they are a team that's dangerous, especially here. And I think they, if they're making some shots and making some plays, that they're pretty tough because they're very athletic and they have guards that can stretch out and the guys have the green light. Um, and I know playing his own, it really comes down to like how you're shooting and sharing the ball. And we didn't share the ball well at all tonight. And I thought we were very, very stagnant in, in, in our movement. I don't think there was much movement. I think we were way too stationary. So I think they took advantage of it. I think the kid Williams just played with more desire than anyone on the court tonight. And I think that he was the reason why they were able to stay close because of his passion. And I think it was contagious with a few of the other players. And I don't think we had that fire that we needed to have. And credit to them, they did. Talk a bit about it. I mean, did he show you any of that on film or did you see anything of that from Williams? I mean, last year, supposedly, did the same thing to our guys mm -hmm. here. And uh, so I saw him before the game, and he was juiced about an hour before the game. He's screaming stuff out and all that. And I try to tell my guys beforehand that Niagara's really ready to play. They're focused. This kid's leading, you know, leading the energy over there right now. And you never, you never know what you're going to get. I mean, they looked, our guys looked okay in warm ups, but didn't look like they were flat when we came out. Okay. Then we get then we get stupid with the ball at times, and we you know make dumb passes that aren't there. We, part of the thing when you have a lot of assists is sometimes you overpass. And I think tonight, early in the game, when we had a little bit of a lead, maybe could have put a little margin there. We had you know big guys against guards in the paint, and they want to throw it to another guard across the lane. And you know I don't think our wings came out ready to shoot. I think Sean Armand did off the bench, but I don't think our other guys were like coming in, catching and shooting. They were like, oh, let me just move the ball and let someone else do it. And you can't you can't play like that. And you know. Niagara was aggressive offensively and took shots. They didn't make them all, but they took them and aggressively chased them down. And they gave us a good fight. You came out early in the second half, and Glover posted up right away, if I remember yeah. right, which is something I don't think we saw at all in the, in the first half. Was that is that something you got away from? Did you want to do more of that? No, I think it's more of Mike's effort. I thought his effort stunk. And, and I think he goes through the motions out there way too often. And he did it today. Uh, he did it the other night against Marist. And I think the second half, you saw him come with a little bit more passion to pursue the ball. Now, a lot of times, bigs in general like to sit there and say, you've got to get me the ball more. And, and my theory is you have, to, you have to work to get it more. I mean, you've got to demand it. You've got to move for position. You've got to work for it. You've got to get rebounds. You've got to get defensive stops. I mean, things you're, doing, you're not doing anything of. Let's not like, sit there and say, well, the guard should get me it more. No, go get some yourself. Work harder than this. Be a stopper. Be an offensive rebound. Everything that Williams really was being. It wasn't everything just being dropped to him. He went out and he got boards and everything too. I mean, that's how you have to play when you're in that position. And, you know, sometimes you got to play that hard, and sometimes you don't. For the most part, Mike has done a great job all year. But I thought, I think the last two games, he's really let up for whatever reason. And it's probably, you know, I've got to do something better to get him more motivated, and I will. Good. Thanks, guys.